This video is a quick demonstration on how to make a tea light candle holder using a small tree log and a few tools. These candle holders are great for the holidays and quite easy to make. Chalk is used to mark off one inch increments in the log. This is easy to see when cutting through bark and great for rough cut purposes. I use a front vise on my grandfather's old workbench. The red clamp is used with scrap wood to help stabilize the log. We are now going to cut a hole through the heartwood of the log. Using a Freud Forstner bit, the hole should be about half inch deep. I like to rock the bit slightly to help it engage the end grain of the log. I am a fan of the Freud Forstner bit. It's European made and it holds a nice edge for a very long time. Forstner bits do have to be sharpened from time to time. There are plenty of videos on YouTube where you can find out how to do this. Next, I position the log with the chalk marks facing up. As you can see, I use a straight edge to help make a 90 degree cut in the log. This is just a rough cut. Sandpaper will help finish any rough surface left by the saw. Any outdoor crosscut saw can be found at your local home center. Once the wood is cut through, take 60 grit sandpaper, move it in a circular direction to remove any rough saw blade marks. I also take the sandpaper and run it along the edge to create a slight chamfer. This softens the edge and makes it a more finished piece. Next use 150 grit sandpaper to really smooth over the top. You can also use 220 grit sandpaper to really make the top and bottom smooth. I typically finish these with walnut oil or tongue oil. These oils bring out the grain and add a nice finish. Let the candle holders dry for a week before using them. Tea light candles can be purchased at any home goods store. These candle holders work well on dining room tables, outdoor patio tables, or bathroom counter sinks. Good luck and use safety glasses.